Hi girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm gonna be talking about Mondays. Now, for most cases, actually for almost every case, a lot of people hate Mondays, whether if they're getting ready to go to work or go to school, after they just wake up from a relaxing, refreshing weekend and they realize, fuck, it's Monday, gotta go to work, gotta go to school. For my, for my cases of Mondays, sometimes my Mondays can be sunshine and rainbows, while other cases, some of my Mondays can be a literal dumpster fire. And that's what happened this Monday. I'm going to do my best to, um, to not go into too much detail on how my Monday was, so I'm just going to try and simplify it. Already, my Monday was off to a terrible start, and my brain decided to be a literal asshole and wake me up at four in the morning. I tried to, you know, calm my brain down with some writing because writing can be a very relaxing thing to do to calm your brain down, not just walking. But for this case, writing didn't help that much. Already I felt a little anxious and overstimulated. I didn't feel like walking on that Monday, so I tried to, you know, take a little nap from waking up at four in the morning before arriving at work. And as soon as I arrived at work already, the kids were acting rambunctious and made me feel overstimulated. And it's not their fault. Kids can be kids. They can be crazy. But there are times when us adults need to do our best to just calm the kids down and, you know, be reasonable with them. I know us adults can try, can at least try to suck it up, but there are times when we just need to let our walls down and step out and that's what happened to me. I got very overstimulated to the point where a few tears escaped my face and one of my coworkers asked me, hey, do you want to step out? And I immediately jumped to saying yes. So I went into a private room to have a panic attack. A lot of people's anxiety can be different, but for my case, my anxiety is a mixture of anxiety and sadness. I'm having a panic attack at one moment while also crying my eyes out at the same time. Anxiety with a mixture of sadness is the worst combination you can ever think of. Even if you try to take medication to suppress your anxiety, it's not going to get it's not going to get rid of your anxiety completely because when you get older, anxiety comes in and literally fucks you up. That's what anxiety is. It just fucks up your whole day and that's what happened. Anxiety was Partially on autopilot when sadness came in to help out anxiety and tag team against me and be a literal bitch to me. If I had to describe my Monday, if Monday was a person, if I had to describe how my day went, could you imagine um, days of the week having their time of the month? If like, my today's Monday was on their period while having a dose of steroids, that's how my Monday went, and my day tried to get better. My Monday tried to get better, but it could not top the terrible start that happened of me being overstimulated and waking up so early in the morning. It was awful, and I was so relieved when I was able to get off work, and you know what I did after? Had myself a drink like any other reasonable adult with a stressful day. Just sit down, have a drink, calm yourself down. You know, there are times when having a drink is not so bad. You can just calm your nerves, and that's what it did for me. It calmed me down, and I did my usual nightly routine before going to bed, and I could not tell you how rest well rested I was when I went to sleep. I woke up Tuesday morning, dozing in and out, my brain's telling me, hey, it's time to wake up. Your shitty Monday is over. But I didn't want to wake up. There are just times where I just don't want to wake up and just want to sleep forever. But the day's got to go on. And if I, if I ever had to say anything to that Monday, fuck you, Monday. I know my channel is called Peaceful Presley. And there are moments on my, in my videos where I'm not so peaceful. But... Just to clarify, to give you guys a little heads up, I am human after all. I can't be peaceful all the time. So if you ever see me have those moments where this little fictional thing could be a real life person and I just want to punch it in the face 
or if my day was terrible during one of the days of the week, it's okay. Not everything in the world is sunshine and rainbows. We all have to take the bad with the good. Got to have a mixture of beautiful sadness in it. We don't know how to stop anxiety. Maybe we can't. Maybe this is what happens when we grow up. You feel less joy. But just because you feel less joy doesn't mean you don't feel any joy at all. And those moments that I quoted, Inside Out 2 and South Park, shout out to those shows and movies. Th those movies and shows changed my life with those quotes. Even if we have a mixture between the bad and the good, we just got to remember that we're all human at the end of the day. We can have to let our walls down. We're not invincible like Superman. And if anybody had a shitty day, just watch this video. You'll feel better. You'll feel related. You'll feel relatable at the end of the day watching this video. Maybe you'll feel better. Everybody has a shitty Monday, including me. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.